Uh, Mwanza Kolia, the head coach of uh, KCB Rugby for the sevens category. Uh, how was the match for you? It was a tough match. Today has, has been a day full of hard games. Quarters was hard, semis was hard. All teams that make that that far worth the opponents, the game would have gone either way. We had to show the character, dig deep, and the fitness also told because uh, the awareness. Uh, Nakuru afterwards they they made some lapses in defence. I felt like we managed to get to get back in the game. So the boys dug deep and the belief carried us through. And uh, for tournament thing, what has been uh, your ingredient that has been working for you? Is it the team or is it the gelling? What seems to be working right for you? One, uh, we had a we had a vision. We had a, a vision to win all all the legs. It was not a a very lofty one. We said it's possible. So we set out to win that. First, we had that vision. We are working towards winning all the legs. Secondly, we have depth in the players. Uh, then we have experience in the national team players. And also the technical bench, the experience of Mike Shamir and Mark Mushila also helps in the team. And the, the character in the team uh, carried us through. Uh, sevens, winning or losing could be a matter of just one, one error. So we had to perfect uh, and make less mistakes, which we are yet to achieve that. So that's, that's, that's really carried us through to win the far we've gone. And uh, going into Driftwood, uh, what lessons do you think this tournament uh, you need to carry on to the next one? Uh, possession is king. Uh, in this last game we were put to the sword by Nakuru because we, we didn't have the ball a lot. <laughs> We, we 
we're looking at being able to retain our restarts. We're looking at uh, making less mistakes because at some point we were making mistakes which were awarding the opponents the ball, uh, especially in the Mwamba game. So we're looking at making less mistakes when we go that yeah, to drift yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. And uh, also considering you've been uh, quite successful in the seventh game, uh, what lessons do you think uh, our national team uh, needs to pick from uh, the seventh circuit? Considering we are going to a World Rugby Sevens uh, Olympic year, early preparation. Yeah. Early preparation is key. A wider technical bench is key. In my obviously unbiased opinion, yeah, yeah. Uh, because the experience, you know, two heads are better than one. Uh, a, wider, a wider technical bench is, is good. Incorporating uh, other 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 heads would, would give a broader outlook in the, in the ideas. Yes. And uh, in terms of uh, players uh, beyond uh, KCB, uh, who have been your standout players for the whole tournament, including also your players? I would say Monate Akwe has been very good, exceptional in the aerial balls. I would say uh, that's Monakuru. Uh, Mwamba will go for Ijera and uh, Agevi. And uh, their winger, I'm forget I don't know, I'm forgetting his name. Uh, for Homeboys, Bush, Bush has been there, but he's not been very consistent. Yeah.